Gavin Gill will go in motion. Winfield carry off the left side. Cuts back. And he's got some running room to the outside. He gets a block. He's got he's got the edge. Pushed out of bounds. Much further downfield. And you know, that's what we've seen all year. And I, I'm talking before the game. I really, the, both defenses are good, but the offenses are superlative. You know, it's, it's going to be a shootout. Bulldogs but not finish off the play and wrap up. Yeah, it sounds so simple. Winfield Win carries off the right side. He's following his blockers, and he just powers into the end zone. Screen pass goes out to Cheney. He slips a tackle, slips another tackle. He's cornered the end zone, and he's going to haul him out at the one-yard line. Coach, we might have had about as good a view as anybody in the stadium for that one. And they're going to call him out at the one-yard line. First and goal. Winfield's just going to follow right behind the offensive line and tiptoe, leap over the... Uh, attempt to tackle that time, and Bulldogs on the board again. Saints and being a five-sport athlete, empty four backfield sport athlete. Here. I like those empty backfields. And pressure coming this time. Winfield's going to scramble out of the pressure. He turns the corner. He's going to have a little bit of room. He gets to the sticks and past the sticks, and no call so far from the – and they're touchdown. going to call it a touchdown, Coach. Winfield into the end zone again. Bulldogs put their third score early in the first quarter. You know, it's it's hard to come back from. You know, it's possible. It's very possible. It's, it's still four minutes left in the first quarter, and they got to realize that. But but Lutcher's making it look easy. It's not easy, but they're yeah. making it look easy. Certainly, mathematically, time-wise, as far as the game goes, there's so many ways. Right now, what Coach Fuller has to worry about is the psychological side of it. That's so right. Appreciate you watching, Miss Nancy. Right. Hand off this time. Oh, actually, just a keeper. That's Winfield, and he breaks a few tackles, and he's going to have one man to beat. And he takes it to the house, and that's a touchdown, Coach. We didn't get a chance to say our hellos, and <laughs> I'm going to have to rely on the replay to get what happened there. Well, back in the day, he used to run like a wham, and that, that, that was a wham, except we didn't hand off the ball. He had two backs leading him. He follows right behind the block of Gavin Gill and Brock Luke in a great job that time by, by number 62 on the Bulldogs' offensive line. That's Ben Clemmore doing a great job just road grading that time. In there to lead block. And they do so, and Winfield's going to carry it to the goal line and in across the goal line, and that's a Bulldog touchdown. Bulldogs go up by two scores with 3.06 remaining in the game. And that one was a a, a gut a gut check. That was a, a That's one of those body blows from boxing, right, Coach? Bone cruncher. Yeah. Bone crunching tackle. It is, it is a tough, tough... When you know one play was run all the way down the field. Yep. You're right about that. And that's going to do it as they won't snap it again. With that said, watch out Champion Square. Watch out Poyager Street. Here come the Bulldogs.